going to talk about something that I did not know about until after I graduated college and started the job I have now. It's sensory science. This is the science food class. We learn about KFC and what the people do. Science and where the food comes from, like chicken. We learned about chicken a few weeks ago. We learned a lot about potatoes and french fries. How would you describe the aroma of your sample? You have 20 characters or less. All the different things that go into making foods. We had like this pop, it was orange soda. We're gonna smell first and then taste. And we got full because it was bright the whole time. So it's exposure, showing the girls that food science is something that affects them in everyday life, having them think about where their food comes from, and having a safe space to ask questions. They've learned about the basics of food safety, hand washing, time temp abuse, that kind of stuff. We learned about polyphenol oxidase, uh, which is the specific enzyme that will turn your fruit brown when it's cut. My favorite experiment in this class was the clay. Oh, it's making like Play-Doh, our own Play-Doh. That was very cool. My favorite activity was probably uh, last week's when we got to um, do an egg drop and we, that was the week we learned about packaging. We had to package the egg and make sure that it was safe before we dropped it. So that was the, the smell. What do you all think it tastes like? I have a feeling where we're going with this. So looking at our department in food innovation and technology, I was like, you know, there's a little bit of diversity, but there's not a lot. I would like to see more. So I started doing research to try to understand if that was just our experience or if that was across the board. And it turns out that African Americans are 14% of our population. Only 5% of them go on to try and pursue a food science degree. So we thought maybe, you know, this is very small, but maybe we can reach some of these young scientists in middle school, get in their minds early, and then we'll have more young food scientists of color. Ms. Cosby always says the girls can't be what they can't see. So to see women in a field um, um, like food science and seeing that there does need to be more um, African-American representation um, is really what the class is all about. So giving them that exposure, having them do a lot of hands-on activities to be able to see, touch, feel, and taste what it's like to be an actual food scientist. Honestly, I think it's really interesting, so it's probably up there, but I have my heart set on being a teacher. So I would be that before I would be um, part of the food science field, but I do think it's really cool.